Whew. These very, very late nights are finally getting a massive toll on my day. Like, I woke up at, like, look, this is the time right now, 1.47. I woke up maybe half an hour ago, had a quick shower, and then I was like, shit, where did my day go? I need to go to High Point to get a raffle for the Black Ultra Boosters. So I'll speak to you guys soon. Let's have some coffee. I still need to go to Jamie's house, but I'm not sure why he isn't picking up his phone. Me and him are the same in that way. We just don't pick up our phones like ever, like ever, ever. Like this is my train of thought. If it's that important, you would have Philly's number and you would call Philly and Philly will call me or tell me and that is the extremeness of the importantness that I will answer something like that. If that even makes any sense at all. Do you know what I realized? Whatever I just said before, it sounds kind of snobbish, but you guys are gonna understand that my phone is my, like my business runs through my phone. So I have literally set a time and place where I go through my phone, check my messages, check my like Facebook messages, YouTube, Instagram, all that stuff. I put a time slot of my day. So I'm not literally just sitting there like every, like every moment of the day refreshing my phone. Like I know people like that. I know people that sit there and just like, mm, I need a refresh to see if I get anything. You're not missing out on anything guys. Like the world's in front of you. That's my social media rant for today. Ooh, there you guys are. I have finally decided to leave the house. I haven't left the house all day yet. I haven't left the house for a couple of days, to be honest. I've just been working, working, working. Um, I'm gonna go to High Point. As I told you guys, I'm gonna meet up with Joe. If you guys don't know who Joe is, it's the JC lifestyle guy. Where the hell are my keys? That's how long I haven't left. Do I even have like my wallet? What the hell is wrong with me? All right, time to leave. Let's go. Wow, I cannot believe these are sitting on shelf. What the hell, babe, do you want a pair? I'll buy you a pair. These are super nice. But what the hell are these colorways? Ugh. I really don't know what color I'm gonna go. There's a whole bunch of different colors. And Philly wants me to go like a nicer blue. Not a pink Joey. Not a pink Joey. Vegan, Come on, bro. bro. Yeah, vegan. This, this stuff is vegan. How weird is that? So random. Um, I was thinking about this, but this looks like the blue that I have on already. Uh, I think this is the one that Philly wants me to go, so I might just buy this one. I think this is the right one. Today, I've decided to wear a dress, as you guys can see. No, it's a Y3 Adidas, really, really long, like, look how weird it looks. It looks like I'm wearing a dress. Hey, Joe, does this look like I'm wearing a dress? Yes. It's cool, though. I like it. It's a, yeah. Uh, topped up with, yeah. NMDs. Finally got my raffle for the Foot Locker thing and I'm number 37. According to Joey right here, he said that it's going to be an easy cop. So let's hope for tomorrow morning. We are, what are we having? Ramen. 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 Check out the egg stack, so. <laughs> <laughs> he got two extra eggs, like a full two eggs. Why do you charge you two eggs rather than half? No, it's always by half. It's weird. There's this Asian lady, like somewhere there. And that's where the music's coming from. That's really annoying. Giyos is, as always, the best. Ramen is here. Look how funny Joe's one is. He has like 20 million eggs. I don't understand, bro. You must really like your eggs. I'm not even gonna lie. I told you guys. This is the only time I eat my eggs. Like, I don't like the eggs. Like, anything else besides ramen. Ramen eggs are the best. Yeah, ramen eggs are the best eggs to eat. Hi. That's for you. That's for you, babe. I bet you it's gonna be one that I don't like. Do you like it? Yeah. See, told you. Ah, oh, there's something in here as well. Tam and Anita got you something. Oh really? Yes. I'll, I'll pop by their shop. It's that. It's 
Do you have like two things in? That's yours. Clearly, that's yours. Oh my god, it's so cute. Thanks, guys. How cute oh is it? Oh my god, it's so pretty. Yeah, that's your highlight. Highlighters? Yeah. Wow, so cool. They're vape highlighters, babe. This is really cool. Got it. How cool is it? And there's a blue one. Oh my god, so many little goodies. Yeah, the Nike store. Oh yeah, we've got those. We have so many of these. <laughs> Thanks guys, this is awesome. Oh, there's a camera one too. Good afternoon, I finally got my hands on a camera. Just thought I'd have a little chat with you all because my vlogging game has been really bad lately. But a little update is I took off my nails. If you can see, they're really ratchet and ugly. This one over here is so painful. Like I had to rip it off and everything because one of them broke off this morning and then I wanted to go to the nail salon to get them removed. But because I finished school so late, they're already closed, which is super annoying. And I'll speak to you guys in a little bit. Bye. E-A-R. Well, Eric told you first. Apparently, it's in gossip room. It's on this table. So exciting that everything fits on this table. Isn't that so weird? What a weird thing so to get excited. Sad. We got it. We're getting excited because everything fits on a table. That's freaking what has life come to. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Good morning, guys. I am stuck in traffic. Now I know what Philly fucking hates every morning. I'm supposed to get to High Point at 8 o'clock for a sneaker raffle, and literally, I'll be Ah, sitting in traffic for like half an hour now and now it's eight o'clock and I'm worried sorry I'm gonna hold you guys like this I'm worried that my number will get drawn out and I'm not gonna win so annoying I freaking hate people I hate traffic I don't hate people I just hate traffic and people who cause traffic fucking unbelievable so literally I was stuck in traffic and now the full locker it's called out my number and I'm literally walking the Foot Locker right now and they've already called out my number and supposedly there's no more sizes left which is I don't know what I'm gonna do just left sneaker boy and literally that's two losses in two in like literally in like two hours one we didn't I didn't even rock up early enough and then this one they just literally sold out which was insane like there wasn't that many people in line. Andy, how many people were in line? Like 20 uh, people? I reckon 20 or 30. Yeah, and they sold out on everything. So what, they only had like four pairs, like... Uh, half a dozen pairs at least. Yeah, like literally six pairs of everything. Which is super annoying. So, I'm gonna try to cop on mine. Oh, there's this camera. I'm not gonna lie, I'm having one of those days that I'm literally just sitting here doing nothing. I'm not doing nothing. I'm never doing nothing. I'm just doodling on my computer, figuring out uh, what I'm gonna do next with my brand, with cocaine and stuff like that. But today has been just a day full of L's. Just L's everywhere. So, you guys saw me go to Foot Locker this morning. L. Sneaker Boy this morning. L. I went to Adidas on Burke Street. Another L. So... Uh, Andy decided, he's like, hey bro, do you want to go to Chadston and get a raffle for tomorrow? And I was like, you know what? It can't get any worse. Susie it cannot get any worse. So I was like, you know what, whatever, let's go. He's going to come pick me up. We're going to go to uh, Chadston and see if I don't, if I can get another raffle and I make the raffle this time. Because I can't believe they drew my number and I didn't, oh, I just wasn't there and I was stuck in traffic. What a day. What an absolute day. If you guys are wondering where Philly is, she's at a fashion show. You guys should know by now. There's only one camera. She broke the other camera. We're waiting for that camera to come back. Funny story. Literally, we were in the car and I was trying to buy some shoes for Andy. And he was like stressing out and I bought it in one go. And he copped the, those ultra No, because I tried for five minutes and couldn't get them. See, and I tried in like one minute and I got it straight away. So we're at Chadston right now. We're going to try to go to this Foot Locker and get a raffle and see if I get a win up here, but I highly doubt it. Highly doubt it. I've been taking L's all day. L's all day. We are currently eating at Grilled right now, but the Foot Locker has 14 pairs. It's 14 pairs of these shoes, right? And it's 350 people. The odds of that, it's 
not worth it. Like, I have to wake up at like six o'clock to drive to this place, sit in traffic for like two hours, and go to a raffle that I might not win. It's so not worth it, to be honest. So, I'm just gonna waste my time coming here, just checking out this place, and then I'm just gonna go back home and yeah, wait for Philly. Look at the size of this burger. That's my phone. That's the size of the burger. This place is awesome all the time. Pineapple, bacon, patty, tomato, some other shit. Let's eat. We're gonna play best out of 10. As you guys can see, the basketball ring's right there. Best out of 10. Right. Let's go. Um, I don't know how to say this, but, um, I'm going to stop the vlog right here. Uh, my dad was admitted into hospital early today and, um, I've been having a hard couple of days already. So I just want to be honest with you guys. I don't want to put like a fake front that I'm okay or I'm happy or whatnot so I don't know when I'm like I'll, I just need a day maybe a day or two just do my own thing and um just you know uh get myself together sort of thing but um Philly's gonna be vlogging a bit more now um yeah Tough times. I'll speak to you guys whenever I see you guys next. Um, you guys are gonna see a cool video on Sunday though, but what a rough day. What a rough day. I'll speak to you guys later. Thanks. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching our video guys. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. It looks like this. You guys don't know what it looks like. Subscribe button will be under here, anywhere around here. Just click anywhere around here. And if you haven't watched our previous video, our vi previous video will be over here. Japan, how to bid on things in Japan, and also things off Facebook. So don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. Let's start the video. <laughs> Alright guys, so the first thing you want to do is sign up to a PayPal account. The best thing about PayPal is it allows you to actually 